What's up, Internet? That's right, it's Gold Hog Gaming coming back in the night, and God, it feels good to be home. Back in the RPG Fight Club. I'm Aaron. And I'm Mystic. Yeah, Mystic's here too. What? That's right, you got both of us here for the RPG Fight Club debut of Vinny and the Dark Revival. This game is a, a this game is a ink filled horror fest that um It's not that scary though. It's not that scary. It's not like Poppy Playtime. But psychologically Oh, this game is about to fuck y'all up. Let's get real about that. For those of you who uh for those of you new to the Bindi sensation that uh about four years ago swept the uh world. Uh, Benny and the Ink Machine is the story of uh, an animator named Henry, who, well, Henry used to draw cartoons for a living, until he got laid off by his boss, who basically stole credit for everything, and um, then started some cult ritualistic shit in which he sacrificed his own employees to bring his car to bring cartoon animations to life. Trapping them inside of the animation studio in an endless cycle of death and rebirth. Slowly wiping them out to create perfect copies of his animation. The end of the first game comes with Henry finally defeating the ink demon. Freeing himself only to realize he's caught in a loop. So we have no idea what the hell's going on with Bendy and the Dark Revival, um, but we're about to find out. What we do know is that this is someone else's story, and we are looking forward to it. So, that being said, let's go ahead and get over here to the game feed. There we are. Already the dark overtones with the rain dripping ink. The ink stain painting letters inscribing. It's fucking dope as shit. Get that audio on. Get that audio on. All right. And well, I know I know what y'all want. I know what y'all want. Wait, 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 wait. Wait. What? Wait a minute. We're doing what? a horror game. We want people to be scared, right? I mean, you want people to be scared? Okay, okay, in that case, we will we will forego that. Yes. And I will turn the music back up. Yes. All right, so here we go, ladies and gentlemen. It's time. Here we go. Yeah. I'm gonna uh, have no choice here but to turn my uh, screen up so that I can actually hear as well. So, I'm gonna have to move the mic out a bit so that, uh, we can both talk to y'all. And it not pick up all my stuff. Checking, uh, I'm checking the audio settings. Okay, it looks like we're good. Looks like we're good. So, um, hmm, I've visited the studio before. Except, I, it, here's my thing, right? From what little we've already played of this game, we know this is not the same studio. But I don't want to play a game on easy mode. Because that feels like just the wrong thing to do. You want me to do it normal? Yeah. Alright. Uh, start a new game for an autosave will be overwritten. Yeah, we're fine with losing our autosave data. I will say I have successfully broken Mystic of... The I don't I, I can't lose my uh, my my save data fear as she has watched me delete save data time and time again just because 
I fucked up. We're always <laughs> free to choose. I have an issue when it comes to Pokemon. What we Fuck want you. to believe. But when you step back, when you really look Joey at where apartment. you've been and the things you've done, your past will come to devour you. You go, little guy. And only 800 more frames to go. Bindi! Yeah, get through tonight without some coffee. Probably some downstairs. Time for a little adventure. All right, so we are playing Audrey, who's apparently the employee of the month. I also have a feeling Audrey's probably the only employee left. If we know anything about Joey Drew Studios. Take a look around, see what's going on here. Oh, that sensitivity is not going to work. Also, probably shouldn't have done the smiley bobby, uh, smiling bobby that long. Like, my head's still kind of bobbing yeah. a little bit. <laughs> Okay, we can fix the sensitivity. So, yep, we got our bendy, our little bendy pic, uh, stickers. Alice, Angel, Bendy, and Boris the Wolf. A whole bunch of little cool snippets. Can I zoom in? Ah, what does it say? Congratulations on your success. Your best pal, Henry Stein. Henry? Henry. Henry, huh? See, that's the whole problem. I can't actually read that. Okay. Archgate Studios. Can't actually search the file today. Oh. Oh, that's what we look like. Oh, look at us. So young, so vibrant, and full of life. That is the ugliest wool sweater I have ever fucking seen. Girl, I can tell you out of the out of this one. Not all right. All right. All right. All right. Oh, more animation equipment, sketchbooks. It looks like. How to animate. So it looks like a whole bunch of uh, studio and workbooks. Ah, cold drinks. Oh my goodness. Cold root beer. When you can't get the when you can't get the rights. Yeah. MT crossed <laughs> out. Like when you couldn't get the rights for the sponsorship. So, um, it's actually pretty funny, um, Gravity let me, uh, said something to me earlier that kind of threw me for a loop, that there was some legal dispute, so apparently Bendy has been discontinued. Yes. Oh, there is some legal, 
there is some, uh, there is a legal battle over who actually owns Bendy. There is more Alice Angel sketches. Mystic loves Alice Angel. Um, but yes, yeah, so, like I was saying though, um, so apparently there's a dispute between the developer and, uh, Meatly, the creator over who actually owns it. The developers are claiming that they own it and are suing the Meatly for the rights. Whereas the Meatly is going, I created it. You're not, you don't get to claim you created it just because you worked on it. Okay. Um, this has led to a long drawn out legal battle in which the development, uh, the development, uh, the, the animation uh, company went bankrupt. Yeah, so, corporate greed brought an end to this franchise. That's ridiculous. It's fucking wrong. I agree, 100%. Um, but, here we are, playing Bendy and the Dark Revival because we love Bendy. Nathan Art. I'm guessing the CEO and founder of uh, Archgate Studios. How do I jump? I can't jump. Okay. Can't search that. Can't search anything. bunch of different animation sketches of characters. My heart's pounding. Thunderclap. Super effective. Archgate. Pictures. Kind of looks like an Ouroboros on there. You see it? Yeah. That's interesting. Apparently, Archgate's pictures really wants their fucking logo everywhere. Uncle Sal's Pizzeria takeout menu. Thing I brought my own key today. All right, time to go shit ourselves on our way back to the office. Oh look! It's a bendy. It's a bendy. Cut out. Who put this here? Bendy the demon. Here's the key.
found it, man. The most welcoming hallway I've ever And then seen. the mop just moves by its fucking self. Right? Yeah. Like, know, bruh. It's, it just, like, you know, wants to clean its own uh. floor, man. It's like, man, it's a little dirty. Oh, sorry, it's scary there. That's what I do on the nightly. Bruh, like, <laughs> I, I, I'm not even joking. I can't express this enough. I don't actually like horror games. Okay. I don't know why I enjoy this shit out of Bindi. I don't. God damn it, it's already giving me a fucking heart attack. This is how I feel when I play all horror games. Every single horror game I've ever played, I feel that way. I feel like I'm just gonna have okay. a heart attack and die. Okay. You got this, Aaron. You got this, Aaron. You got this, Aaron. Hello? Is someone there? Grab the check underneath the uh, underneath the desk. That's not some freaky ass shit there. Not. Thank you, Audrey. You look like you could use a little company. So, it's been really nice this past week. Just beautiful. Don't you worry, my dear. It's just a little short in the system. Happening a lot these past few days. No need to fret. Let's see what we can find. Come along now. Old Wilson will protect you. <coughs> I don't trust you, missing eye guy.
Joey Drew is the founder of the studio and the man who created Bendy Lies. Mm-hmm. Liar, liar. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> One of the most beloved cartoon characters of all time. In 1929, with the help of his business partner, Henry Stein, he created Bendy's first short, Little Devil Darling, as an early talkie cartoon. As his entertainment legacy grew over the years, Joey's optimism and pioneering spirit never wavered. Starting with just a pencil and a dream, he cre- created this studio. Here at Arscape Pictures, we strive to continue his dream and see Bendy live on. Dreams come true. With Alice Angel, she sings, she dances, sent from above. Presented in Silly Vision. Look at this man taking credit for shit that ain't his. Silly Vision. Hello, my honey. Hello, my darling. Let's get the lights turned on. Hey, look. It's a banjo. And it's Trippy Wilson in the background. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> Forest! <laughs> the Bendy Sing Along. Ten favorite children's songs. Caution. Wet floor. <laughs> Wet floor. Bendy in the butcher gang. The dancing demon. Gentlemen, looks like someone's been messing with the exhibits. There should be something on each of these pedestals. Audrey, sweet Audrey, do an old man a favor and go find them. I'll tend to the power. Oh, 
we have no idea what's going on here. Look, all the exhibit pieces are the exact same ones they were in the first game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Literally the exact same ones. The doll, the gear. Like I said, they're the same ones from the first game. The only difference is instead of making you run all over the first floor to find all of them like they did in the first game, they put them all in one room to expedite the process. So here goes Bendy. Like, a part of me just wants to point out, it says flow, not power. It does say flow. It is done. Wilson? Oh, all trees. The things you've set in motion.
What's happened to you? So we'll go ahead and read this. Every great story begins in mystery. Although things may be dark at the start, the truth will illuminate your way. Don't be afraid of who you are. Fear only what you may become and banish it away. Take that. Grant Cohen, in accounting, please inform Mr. Drew that despite his insistence that the rumors of Drew Drew Studios going bankrupt are untrue, I want to remind him that if his studio does indeed fail, all equipment and experiments produced through our partnership by contract belong to the Gent Corporation. We will reclaim these assets forcibly if necessary. Relax. Wilson knows your purpose. The man who killed the ink demon. All right, we'll take those. Henry. What he says. I, I've had that theory for a minute. I really think that maybe it's because of his eye. Yup. I'm, I'm telling you, I had. Geez, you'd think I was drowning kittens the way these people are looking at me. I've never seen such disappointment in a person's eye. But these are the way of things. If management can't pay their bills, then the bank takes the goodies back. Still, it does break me a bit knowing how much I love them old cartoons this place used to make. Oh well, times change. Life moves on. Uh, Tally Wester. You a troublemaker. You a troublemaker. Jack's the first troublemaker, y'all. Joey, Jack and I have been wondering if you could meet with us considering the current situation. We have been with you for 
for many years and we feel we have contributed to the success of Bendy in the past. Our interest is purely in keeping this company strong. We just want to help however we can. Let's talk. Sammy Lawrence. You said earlier that they're having I know, an right? actual right? dispute right? in real life right? and they're having... I was just thinking what about that. Like, god damn. Did they do this on purpose? Friend, your protector. For two hundred and eleven days, you've Getting lived without meta. the ink demon haunting your steps. I banished him away, tore his body in two. In return, I ask just a little favor. Among you, there is a stranger, a young lady. Bring her to me. I should just let them capture me, right? No. Because they beat the shit out of you and you respawn in that thing. different one. The ink drips. The ink drips. Darkness has spread through this studio. The reaching shadows creep around you. Something hungers for you. Corrupted flesh. It's close. So very close. It strains to grab you, choke you from behind. You will feel its breath upon your neck. It is close. Like, really? I'm looking right at it, and you have to fucking do that shit? Oh, yes. You're such a shithead. <laughs> I knew it was coming, man. I did, too. <laughs> it's okay, we'll both get it later, or unexpected bullshit. Well, both. I hope you fucking get it. Are you kidding me? Piece of crap.
Nope. Throwing me a sticky scare. As the winds are changing around here, I'm asking myself, Sean, what are you doing? There's a whole world out there, places to see, family to spend me days with. This here job is just a job. I'll have others like it. No worry there. But the important thing is, we should remember to live. I think it's time I did just that. Sean Flynn. Sean Flynn. Especially with the way he says me thinks. And me self. Guys, I got Mystic playing a horror game again. drink too much of that if I were you. It helps patch you up, but the aftertaste, it's not so good. Easy now, I'm not gonna hurt you. It looked like you needed some help. Don't touch me. What are you? Uh, what is this horrible place? Yeah, I remember my first day down here. I know, Bob John. it's scary, but yep. you're actually pretty lucky. The machine could have turned you into a searcher. You mean that? That thing that attacked me? No, that's a piper. And he's part of a gang, so be careful. I don't understand any of this. I can't think. It was just a second, guys. guys um unfortunately we're gonna actually have to cut it short here we have some company
You sure? Yeah, I gotta go drink it though. Pfft. <laughs> <laughs> I, I gotta drop the violence off at the horse <laughs> bowl. Uh, all right, all right. Go, go drop your kids off. All right, guys. So, like I said, we um, we're gonna go ahead and call it here for right now, uh, for tonight. Uh, just letting y'all get a little sneak peek of what we're gonna be running inside. Uh, uh, we're gonna be running in the RPG Fight Club starting again tomorrow. Um, plus head start with Mystic here, and you know, get y'all that little scream. That's right. <laughs> but that being said, thank y'all for coming. Um. And we'll, I'll see you guys tomorrow. But other than that, I'm Aaron. And I'm Mystic, and I'm totally going to make a highlight of that so you guys can have it forever. Of oh, me shit. screaming. It's great. Oh, shit. Yep. I'm totally going to post it everywhere. All right, guys. <laughs> I will see y'all tomorrow.